hair versus hair. I, Lauren, proclaim hereby agree to all the preceding statements. I will keep my word and allow Joe Osborne to dye my hair in the color of my people to burgundy and gold if the Washington Redskins defeat the Cowboys on September 12, 2010. And I will meet <coughs> all other requirements stated in the contract. If I fail to do so, I will convert to becoming a Redskins fan as long as they may exist. All right, here you go. Take a little pencil. Let's time. go, Joe. Joe. Sign it. This is me signing it. You got a little star this time? Oh, no star this time. Hmm. All right. Must, not be, look, must not be too confident this year. No, no, no. If you look at the A, the A looks like a star itself. What well, it does? All right, Mr. Osborne. I, Joseph Osborne, hereby agree to all the preceding statements. I will keep my word and allow Lawrence McClain to shave my head bald. If the Dallas Cowboys defeat the Washington Redskins on September 12, 2010, and I will meet all of the requirements stated in the contract. If I fail to do so, I will convert to becoming a fan of the Dallas Cowboys as long as they, sh as long as they may exist. I'm going to sign it here with this nice little pen right there. It's a beautiful pen right there. A, pen, a nice pen right there. It says yes, Go Redskins. And High dollar. I'm sorry. You guys only had, like, what, four wins last year? Compared to our, I'm sorry, was it 13? Lawrence, I'm going to tell you right now, you need to shut up. Oh, man. And oh. You guys only have thir You guys only have four wins. That's below a 500. Sir, Mr. McClain. Okay. No, Let's go. No, this no, is Josh, a Redskins fan. Oh, of course. It's kind of hard. Born and raised. Die hard, born and raised. Except. Even though they suck. Game over. Lord Even though they suck. Already. You know, you think now and now is going to do something? What do you think? Oh, what do you, you, what do you, you, you lost happen? already, what my friend. What do you think is going to happen? Huh? What do you think is going to happen? I It'll think McNabb is going to come out and he's going to bomb the field and murder the Cowboys. Really? And the defense is going to eat That's you alive. Not only that, the same from the Eagles, the same, the, that, the, same, the same Eagles that we swept last the year. The defense is going to eat you alive, I'm telling you. We'll be back no in defense. September. No, 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 to be defense, continued. Who do, you have, who do you guys have when you defense? When you see this man no, no. with a funny, funny colored head. Okay. Yeah, that's what's going to happen. That's, that's what's going to happen, right? Joe's he's got to paint bald. He's got to paint his beard, too. No. <laughs> beard is just the hair. No, That'd be awesome, well, that's though. Hair no, 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 on your head. No, no, no. Nah. Yeah. The chicks would dig it. I'm not doing the beard. I'm not doing the face of the hair. They dig it. understand that you can't dye your hair because of your situation um, there's just one problem now first of all I want to mention this first of all were you wearing two earrings I think I think you were wearing two earrings I just wanted to see what that was all about I mean I know you've been gone for a little while now and I just don't know how much has changed in uh, North Carolina I don't know how they do things down there but you know, I know everybody experiments in college, so you know, it's whatever. You know, I'm not not judging you. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm a little parched here. I'm a little parched. Let me get this here. This this should help. This should help a little bit. Hmm, that is good. That is really good. I don't know, just more delicious than usual. I don't know what it is. 
anyway, second of all, you stated that the reason the Redskins defeated the Cowboys was because of a flag. Now, I just wanted to mention that I wouldn't say it's because of the flag. I would say, you know, if they wouldn't have uh, held Mr. Brian Orakpo. And I know you were asking earlier in that video, who do we have on defense? That's one Mr. Brian Orakpo, among other fellows. Laurent Landry, London Fletcher, Rocky McIntosh, D'Angelo Hall. I think you know him. He's the one that picked up that fumble. Well, he stripped it first, and they took it back and got a, a touchdown. I'm sure you remember that. But anyway, if he wouldn't have held Mr. Brian Arakpo, odds are he probably would have, there's really no probably about it, he would have smashed Romo in a really violent way and made him eat grass in a way that would have made Kevin Kolb, or Cobb, whatever you want to call him, jealous. Pounds, and he's able to run down Kevin Cobb from behind. Kevin had no idea that he was being chased from the back side, but the Green Bay Packers dropped eight. They rushed three. There was nowhere for Kevin Cobb to go with the football. Secondly, I'm at, I actually think I'm on third now. Thirdly, you state that you will convert to becoming a Redskins fan this year. Now that's all well and good, but I believe in the video, I believe there's video evidence I can cut back to it right here, that you said as long as they may exist. I think you can see it right here. I will convert to becoming a Redskins fan as long as they may exist. I think that's pretty clear cut. Let's see it again just to make sure. I will convert to becoming a Redskins fan as long as they may exist. And not only that, but I believe you also said that for the rest of your life. I think we can see that right here. I fail to do so, then I will convert myself to a Redskins fan for the rest of my life. Also pretty clear cut. Cut and dry. Lawrence, I'm a good man. I'm a giving man. And I'm not going to force you to become a Redskins fan the rest of your life. However, it will be more than this year. You will become a Redskins fan until you live out the terms of the contract. And the contract never said you had to do it right away. But until you dye your hair a funny color, you, sir, are a Redskins fan. So welcome to the family. Cheers. Mmm, that's good. Anyway, next thing I wanted to mention was since you're no Redskins fan, you need to start acting like a Redskins fan, Mr. Clifton McLean the third and by doing so you should start by telling your father the second Lawrence Clifford sorry Clifton McLean who is a big Texans fan I believe I believe from Texas that next week your team the Redskins are gonna put down the Houston Texans I think you should make it very clear that the Texans are going down to your old man. That'd be a great start. So welcome to the family, Lawrence. Glad to have you, and you picked a great year, my friend. Picked a great year to switch to the Burgundy and Gold because the Redskins are going to win the Super Bowl this year in 2011 at Cowboys Stadium. Couldn't be more apropos atmosphere for it all, don't you think? So welcome. Now, I understand this is kind of unfair, and I may seem like the bad guy here, but I'm not the bad guy. you got to keep in mind that I was humiliated and embarrassed. Don't you remember when I lived out the terms of that first contract? I had to bow down before you like a fool wearing that stupid hat. You remember that, don't you? And, I, and there was no cookies out of the deal. The cookie contract didn't even come in involved. It was worthless. All I did was got embarrassed. 
and it was humiliating. And I'm not not here to, to for revenge. It's just fair, man. You signed the contract, and you even said that to yourself, me on Facebook. You said, you know, a bet's a bet, but this isn't just a bet. This is a legally binding contract, my friend. Now, I know it's a little unfair since you can't dye your hair because of your situation, but man, I couldn't dye my hair because of my situation, so I offered to shave it. You should have planned ahead, as Rocky would say. And as you can see, these plaster all over my walls here. You should have planned ahead. But it'll be okay, my friend. Because the Redskins will treat you right. You picked the perfect year, as I said. Hail the Redskins. Hail victory. I have one more thing to say. Go Redskins. Ha, ha, ha.